here he is. How's it going? So, um, the boys are struggling with penalties, so we need to practice them. And it went alright in practice the other day, but we need to make it a bit more competitive. So, me, Linda, and Daryl came up with the idea of getting some Krispy Kreme donuts to make it a bit more comp competitive. So, between mine and Daryl's team, the winning team will get the donuts, hopefully, the coach too. And uh, hopefully, that'll help them take some better penalties because at the moment, a little bit dodgy. So me and the boys lost the penalty shootout unfortunately, uh, it was best of three rounds, we lost two rounds to nothing, so we didn't even get a point in the end, so we missed out on two boxes of Krispy Kreme donuts, which I would have loved right now. So I even missed the penalty myself, my second one from the second round, so that sucked. So now I'm going to go home, have some beers, drown the sorrows, so I need it, especially after missing the PK and having to run a lap, that killed me, bloody egg running. So yeah, shame on me. I can't blame the boys, I missed my own penalty, so lost as a team. You make it hard to leave. Been around the world, don't speak the language. But your booty don't need a screen. All I really need to understand when you talk dirty to me. So no one showed up in Ada again, shock, great turnout, so come downtown, gonna go to the ice hockey playoffs, Grand, Grand Rapids Griffins, playing the Texas Lone Stars, should be decent, try and get some more footage when I'm in there, cheers Ada. There it is, the legendary Van Andel, gonna watch the playoff game, come on you Grand Rapids Griffins, let's get through to the next round of the playoffs. Here he is. Went and tried a place Devon recommended today called Old Country Buffet. Nailed it. Of course I did. Piggy pig pig. Seven plates, not bad is it? Well, had everything from macaroni cheese, fried chicken, hot fudge pudding, cookies, cupcakes, tacos, pizza, spaghetti, meatballs. I'm in a massive food coma. So I'm gonna sit and watch a load of movies this afternoon. Just don't want to move. Cheers. Here he is. How's it going, guys? So, FA Cup final day. Come on, you gunners. Give me an interesting one because I'm an Arsenal fan. Daryl, the host dad, his hometown is Hull. So, we're going to sit down and watch that later. Unfortunately, I can't watch it live. Got to go to the boys' game. Got a big game away in Wayland. So, hopefully, we win that and I can come back and watch Arsenal win the FA Cup. You beauties. Come on, you gunners.
Here he is. All right, guys, game day again. Two big games today. The boys got a big game away against Wayland, which the other team got intimidated because one guy had a beard, which, sure, at this age is a bit weird, but you get on with it. You still uh, go at them. So hopefully we can win today. It'd be nice to get a win for the boys, a bit of a confidence boost. Second big game of the day, Arsenal in the FA Cup final. Let's hope they win. I'm watching it delayed because I've got to go to this game first and then I'll come home, watch the game with Daryl. He's obviously from Hull. I'm the Arsenal fan. It's going to be pretty intense. I hope the boys pull it off for me. We need a trophy. It's been nearly nine years. It's killing me. I hate all the jip everyone gives me about Arsenal not winning a trophy. So it'd be nice to throw it back in their face. So come on, you Gunners. Here he is. All right, boys did very well. Uh, considering we're playing against 18 year olds, uh, getting better every week. Actually, it's a poor draw, but nil-nil at the end of the day, it's not too bad. It's good to get a tie against a load of 18 year olds, so happy with that. Now I'm gonna head home, watch the FA. Right, didn't get to watch the game till late last night, but come on, Arsenal! You beauties, finally got a trophy after nine years of waiting. It's been killing me. All the shit you get from all the other fans. Oh, you haven't had a trophy in this long. Shut up. Jog on. We got a trophy now, so piss off. Just went and seen Godzilla in IMAX. It was absolutely sick. I'd recommend it to anyone who's not seen it. And it's worth paying the extra money for IMAX if you get a chance. So get out there and watch Godzilla, guys. It's sick. Cheeky uh, Godzilla impression for you. <laughs> 